Hello everyone, welcome back to Celeste Superfecta. Last time we did the city zone and this time we're going into Metroid land. Here we go. So-called submersible designed by apples. So last time we had six levels. There were six instead of five. So I wonder if that's gonna continue or if that was just the only one. Oh, yeah, there's hazards in this game. Okay. Uh, is this a- oh, is this whatever the dash thing is? Yeah. <laughs> How do I do this? There we go. From Super Luminary. But this one is tighter. I love it. Variant specifications. Super dashing. 1.2 dash speed, 1.5 dash duration, five times steering speed. Wait, you can't steer at all with normal dashes. How five times zero is still zero. Well, maybe maybe this is different from an ordinary super dash or something. Maybe it's saying comparing it to something I don't know about. All right, here we go. I read that. Coins. I can't collect them. Battery equals three kilowatt hours. Why do they, why, oh, I collected it. I see, I have to collect it. Why do they call it kilowatt hours? Why don't they just call it jewels, but in hours? It's because watts is a unit of power, but this is talking about energy. So instead of having three symbols, you could just have one. All right, here we go. Oh. Cool. And then, oh, it was, oh, I see, nice. And it's timed. Here we go. Wait. Yeah. Oh, don't jump, bounce. I'm back pretty far. I missed. Can I get back down? No. Okay, it drains, I see. Just straight right. Bounce. Don't hold grab. That was a bad idea. Maybe it's fine. It's not fine. <laughs> oh, I gotta restart every time. Alright, it's safe state to learn it. Uh, okay, let go. Now I can hold. Okay, I see. And then instead of jumping, I want to just dash. Yeah, there we go. All right, so, uh, is that the end of the room? Yeah, it's the end of the room, so... Let's clear that state and go back to the beginning. Not that it's much of a challenge, I just didn't want to have to wait through the, re the discharge every time. Let go. Press. Huh? Yeah. I really like the super dash. Dashing with the throwable can be done from a feather or wall simultaneously holding onto a wall. Thanks for telling me after I get through the room. I'm charging my phone by Goose. Yeah, I feel like that was a tutorial room, so it doesn't really count. So we super dash through. We're down there. We dash up. Wait, can we get? Uh, we might be able to get that battery with just the one dash. So I'm gonna try. We throw it against the spring. It falls down. We get the crystal. We dash and grab. There's a puffer fish in the background, and we're uh, we jump. Maybe we jump after that platform. We get the feather. And we're going up. We bounce off the wall. We bounce off the wall again. New specimen. Be careful. And we throw it into there, and what, dash through? Do we need it again? We do need it again. How are we gonna get, oh, oh it falls into a spring, okay. So yeah. Then we fall down, we get the, mm, we have a crystal, we dash again to 
We give ourselves time. Get the thing to come out. We grab it. We hit the feather. We fly up to the right. Oh, it's going back and forth between springs. Okay. So then we go up to the right. We have a dash. We're feathering as far as we can. Probably dash right into the next feather. Maybe curve around this. And then we fly through the... Uh, bounce off the ceiling. Fly over here. Probably dash up there. And then we're done. Uh, 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 yeah. Nah. Probably don't want to, we probably want to jump first. There we go. Oh, I missed. Well, it is a race level, so we should, I could try fast falling. No, that's too fast. I wonder if anyone in the actual race got this far, or if time ran out. There we are. Right, I want to jump off that. Wait, I could jump off that wall, or I could jump off the lower wall and then the upper wall. Yeah, let's do both walls. Bounce. Bounce. Oh, I should stop grabbing. All right, that kind of automatically went in. Whoops. And I gotta remember to go down at the end. Oh, right, I'm not supposed to, not supposed to get the feather yet. So you see this crystal here on the right? I'm wondering if I'm meant to dash there. To dash out of the feather with that crystal and then just kind of go around these two L's with two dashes. That kind of makes sense. Hmm. Wait. Uh. Oh, I see, I see. So, dashing just once with this crystal is not enough. So, the idea I have is that I'm falling, then I dash up to the next crystal, and then I dash back to get the battery. Oh, by the way, some of you mentioned that this genre of music is called Electro Swing. Come on, no! So is the I'm charging my phone joke based on the idea that we pick up the charges and then it lasts like three seconds before it needs to be charged again. All right, got it. Okay. Oh right, I dash out of the feather. There we go. Bounce. Uh, nope. Dash again out of the feather. And then that's the end of the screen, right? Wait a minute. Something just happened. The battery receptacle is there! Oh! So, I wanna... It's okay to throw the battery as soon as I get out of this feather. Alright. Whoops. <laughs> there we go. Marine phone. I cast. Why is there an O1 here? Oh, there's an O2 here. I was like, this isn't level one. So what do we got? We want to dash and do our super thing into the battery, then jump off that platform, hit the 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 feather. It says hold left. Do we just feather in there, or do we dash out of it? Oh no no no. Okay, we hold left and bounce off of that thing. And then, I think that might be a message for keyboard users. Just hold the left key. Just kind of bounce around here. Because we do have to go up to get around here. So we bounce, bounce, and then here we dash out of it. And then we throw it while we're up there, most likely. Yeah, right into there. No, mm, that's where it's gonna go. We will have to... Hmm. But like, there's all this stuff. Oh, no, no, it won't. 
Because I know it will. Wait, why would we want it to go in there? There's more stuff over here. Oh, it opens this door. Okay. So we get the feather flying around. Um, do we, wait, do we want this feather? Maybe we don't. Maybe we want to go directly up to this thing. Dash up and around. And then we have no dash. Well, somehow we want to dash up to get the feather out of here. Then bounce off that wall. Go down. Uh, dash up and around. Throw the battery into... Well, I guess we'll probably get that that copper coin. They look kind of copper to me. I get, see there's a lightning bolt on them. That's only, that's three, okay. And it lands there. We dash around into the feather, then we feather up. And uh, before we get the feather, we grab the other one and we're feathering up and somehow the camera can go up. Hey look, it's Madeline on the phone on the left. So we're feathering up here. We grab the wall out of the feather and we have the battery. We dash around here, throw it there, and that's the end. Okay. Gotcha. There we are. Wait, jump. There we are. Oh, oops. No, don't dash. Just hold. Oh, no. Literally just holding left works. <laughs> that's unexpected. All right, throw it. Oops, forgot. You know, what even is this white liquid? Pure liquid energy. It would be water, because E equals MC squared. Anything with mass is pure energy. Doss. I did not want to get the feather, that's right. Save it. So the feather does come back, so I guess I could get it. Yeah, that's easier than what I was trying to do with the crystal. Yeah, better than before. There we go. Just gotta not hit those electrics above me. All right, so that's that. And then I fall down, dash through the battery and get the feather again. Oh, and there's a little platform for the battery to land on. For some reason going up, left, up, is harder for me than going up right up. Ooh, gotta be careful with that dash. There we are. Oh, I forgot to grab. Yeah. So I got it. I don't think there are any more surprises. Yeah, so that'd be how it is. Time to clear the state. I don't know if I'm gonna beat it this play session just because it's so close to my bedtime, and I'll give it a good go. Yeah! That was very fast, actually. All right, so this time, Wait, what was that? A block that crumbles when you touch it. You can do it! Drop cargo here. Hold right. All right. I will do this in the next play session. I got some good stuff tonight. So I'll see you guys soon. I'm back. If I'm right, there should be three rooms left. Cargo Uplift by Ricky06. You can do it! Drop cargo here. <laughs> All right, so hold right. That means we dash up and hold right. So we should hit the bubble. We might have to dash a second time into it. I doubt it though. So looks like we want to grab the, f uh, huh? Oh, maybe if we hold right, we can go under the block. And then we go up and we go through it to the left. We have to pick it up. Hmm. I mean, we can't make it all the way to this thing. Also, the... Oh, it, does, it is going up. <laughs> the blockers. The bino blockers make it hard. Alright, so... There's stuff here, but we don't want to go there yet. So, the cargo probably moves these blocks. 
that we can access the next ones. It probably moves these blocks too. Like if we drop something here, it should bounce up. Maybe maybe these blocks move so that those batteries bounce up. All right, so where do we need to, to drop it first? This one is difficultly readable. Okay, we might we might be able to drop both batteries. There are two batteries in this slot. We gotta find a place to put the. Wow. What? No. <laughs> You make a level this big. This is such a big level. There, okay, that's the third spot. That's a spot. There's two spots. Wait, there are only three batteries, though. Are we dropping them into portals or something? Okay, let's try to make sense of this. Do what feels the most natural. So we dash up into the feather. We hold right, get underneath the platform. Then we go up, and we would need to have a battery before we go up. So we go, we dash left. We grab a battery, and... We just drop it immediately. No, we dash it when we we angle ourselves up, and then we hop off. Well, it does seem like we would need to uh, grab this while in the feather and the battery, but we can't do that. I mean, we could try climb jumping with it. That would be tough. And then we'd be up here. We don't have a dash. Okay, so yeah, maybe we just drop it. Maybe we just drop it into that box, and there's a portal down there or something. So then we're up here, and we don't have a battery, and we jump, and we don't have a dash either? That's not right. Okay, well, let's see what happens if we just get the drop the battery in there, if anything opens up to us. Oh! Oh, it breaks it. Okay. <laughs> so we break it, and then we're holding right, and we go through here with the feather, and at that spot, these are usually the signal for dashing, right? So we dash upward and to the right, grab the battery before it goes up there. Or do we want to wait till... No, maybe we want to wait for it. So we dash around, dash around, wait... Yeah, dash around, then dash here, and we have another crystal. Then we dash around in a, in a square, and dash left into the battery. And then angle ourselves up, maybe? Yeah, we just go to the end. What's the problem with that? <laughs> so it says down and around, down to the right. So we've got the battery, it has nothing. So we probably just, just coast through here and hit one of the feathers. We bounce up around here, charge the battery. Wait. What, would we want to drop it? Hmm. Maybe we do. Oh, no. Here we go. Here we go. This, with this feather, we bounce on all three of these. And drop all three of them. Ah ha ha ha. And then, yeah. Then we grab here. So all three of the batteries are down. We're coming over here. We grab one of them. And we charge it up. Wait. There's only two coins here. Not sure about that. Does it grab a third coin on the way? No, it doesn't. So how do we... How do we get that third coin? It's not up. One, two. That's all. And then we chuck it to the right. We'd have to chuck it to the right because there's a one way here. Is that a one way? Or is it just decoration? I feel like it was just decoration in a different level. Well, assuming we have it charged up, we throw it in there, and that probably moves one of these spots. There's a charge down here. Anyway, then we're falling. We're just falling. And we have a dash. And then we gotta drop one of them down here. This level's big and confusing. Let's just try it a little. Bounce, bounce, bounce. There we are. Jump. Uh. Okay, there's three batteries there. They each have one charge. Nice. How do they each get one charge? <laughs> oh, the sparkles underneath them. That must be a coin. So they each have one charge already. So yeah, we drop one of them in there. And then, I mean, there's just there's three of them right here. Like, do we like grab one, throw it immediately so it goes down the chute, and grab the next one? Okay, so I'm in a different spot right here. This is not where I expected to be. I expected to be up here. So, yeah, I could go around, but the batteries aren't up there yet. So I grab one of them out of here, and then I have to... 
hit this. Is there a sparkle? Yeah, yeah, there's, there's a coin down there. So I just grab it and then throw it immediately because then it hits the coin and falls down there. And then I have to go back to the left. Like maybe there's still a battery bouncing down here. So I, I throw it and then I dash down and to the left and grab the battery and then I'm coming down. And then I dash, or I don't have to go down, I just dash through here again, and up. Yeah, I grab the battery, maybe I jump off of this... Maybe I jump off of the one way. No, maybe I just... Maybe I just coast through, and throw it at the right spot, and then dash up here again. So then that's taking care of two of them. One of them is down there, one of them is down here. And then I'm riding this again. Yeah, come on, go up! And I jump off, and I go around here, dash to the right, and there's a battery again. And then I just coast through here. I don't know what this down arrow is for. Probably gonna have to worry about it. Then this one has one, and it goes, uh, bounce off here, bounce off there. Chuck it into here, to the right, because I can't get to the left. I chuck the battery to the right. I mean, maybe if I chuck, maybe if I chuck the battery underneath it, it'll bounce up. But I go to that one, and then that thrusts these two blocks upward. Where's this one to the left go? It just goes right in there, and this one here thrusts up and goes right in there. Okay, that's how you get the battery in there. So all the batteries are in. I probably want a fast fall then, and maybe I have a dash, I'm not sure. I fall down into the next feather. I go around, and there's a block here now, apparently. Wall bounce, do a final dash, and get up here. Alright, there's still one crystal I'm not sure about, so I think there's still one thing to figure out. I've generally got the idea. Okay, so I can throw that battery anywhere, and I'll hit a wall and fall in. Hmm, I just saw a problem. If I dash up to here, then I don't have another dash. Come on, screen, go up. Then I don't have another dash to get around up here. So I have to figure out a way to... Well, maybe I can dash into the feather again. Let me see if I can do that. Yeah. There we go. Nice and easy. And then I gotta dash to the right as soon as I can. I missed both of them. There we go. Oops. There we go. Whoa! That explains it. Okay. <laughs> There's no feather. Alright. So, that's where that last crystal comes in. So, I have to... It looks like I want to... I mean, I could just dash straight up. I could wall bounce. I don't think that'll kill me. I think there's enough space. But I want to wall bounce off of that door. Yep, there's a door here. And then I use the last crystal wall bounce off of this one. I just realized something. 06. Sometimes people put their birth year as a number. Does that mean Ricky was born in 2006? Where are you, 18? It's like half my age. Alternatively, it could be that Ricky 1 through 5 was already taken. No! Yeah! You know what? Super Dash Rooms feel like they're gonna be hard, but they're really not. Tai Kim Appreciation Day. Is that a... Like a K-pop band or something? It sounds familiar, but I don't really know what it is. Nope. Oh. Alright, Super Dash. Buff Zucchini! Alright, so... We want to do a diagonal up into... The spring. And then what do we want to do? Probably go up there. We grab it. We... Oh, we can go up here. Uh, no, I guess we we don't want to go up there. <laughs> so what's over to the right? It's just a feather. Just the, Why would we want a feather? 
Oh, oh, we go up, we grab the battery, but we bounce over the feather, and then we hit this thing while we have a feather so that we can do... Oh, no, 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 we throw the battery to the right, get the coin, then bounce, grab the battery, land in the feather, then we land here. So, when we get to the top, we can do a dash. We can go up and around. Uh, where do we want to put the... Oh, throw the battery to the left. All right, once we get this last coin, we throw the battery to the left. And then we grab this... Wait, no. Um, then we just fall through and dash around so that we can grab this battery and then do a jump off of here. Super dash! <laughs> Great art. And then we have the battery. We throw it into the springs. Super dash up to the right and then up again, or maybe just into the wall, and then we jump off the wall, grab the battery, jump into the feather, fly around, bounce off of here, and go there and dash to the left and up. Three kilowatt hours. Well, if it's three kilowatt hours, and we drain it in like five seconds, say like six seconds, that is a power of Three kilowatts times 30. Oh, 90. 90 kilowatts. These are 90 kilowatt batteries. Oh, and then the room's done. This is an easy one. I did a big hard one just last room. This one's so easy. We just dash around with our battery, chuck it to the right, grab here, jump, grab here, and dash to the right. Oh man, this one's gonna be so easy. Guys, this is still my first try. Dang it. <laughs> oh, how awesome would it have been if I beat it my first try? Man, the, the, the quantity of time that I am dancing in my chair to this music is very high. Oh. Twice in a row. That's called skill. Yeah, I forgot what to do. Three times in a row. Hell yeah! That room is so easy. The future is boiling water underwater. Yes. All those, uh, submonauts exploring the ocean depths for science and exploration. By apples. I still don't know who is the high-density one. Is it apples? Just gotta keep pressing buttons as fast as possible. Let's look at it, see what's going on here. So, we jump, dash up and around, grab, and then go up. <laughs> We, we grab the battery, and we're up here, and we toss it through here. So make sure not to throw it in the spiky place. We toss it through the open space, and we fall down. We grab this, and we might have to fast fall. We'll test. And then we dash up and around and grab it so it's like right, diagonal, right. We grab it, and we hop off of there straight into the feather. Bounce, bounce, land, and we're riding. And we could go straight up, but we don't have enough coins. We only have two. So, we dash to the left and up. And we've got ourselves a third one. We throw it into that spot, and we have no dash or anything, so we can't do anything over here. So we have to go over here quickly. No, that doesn't make sense. Uh, <laughs> well, maybe it does. So it's over there. Um, there's another coin up there. And we can get up there. So wait. One, two, three. I mean, it kind of looks like we want to go up this wall twice. Once just straight up, and once to the left. The question is, which one first? I mean, it might make sense to go straight up first. So we're holding on to here and we jump, and we, no, we dash, because we get got the crystal. We dash upward and we fly right up here. Then we drop the battery and, um, well, this dash thing suggests we want to 
dash around to this door. What's over here? Is this the end? The end is here. Okay. And at the end, finally, we get to room two. See? O2. Or does it say D2? Oh, we need a battery over here. Okay. So here's the second battery. All right. So, okay, maybe this one opens this door. So what if we get the get the dash crystal, we dash around, then we're here. No, no, we can't get to the left. We can't get to the left if we go up first. Where's the other? Is there another? We gotta drop the battery off somewhere. So this one has one up there. We have to bounce. Okay, let's just let's just look at what we have to do over here. So somehow we're getting over here. Uh, if we dash and then go up, we won't be able to get over here. So we need to have a dash that lets us go to the left. So we go to the left, down left, left. Hit the crystal and buffer a dash down and up and around. Grab the battery and the feather. We bounce off here. This door needs to be open. So that suggests this one has to be connected. So we bounce off here, break this block, go through the door, bounce off the, the, that, the wall, grab the up wall, dash down after we get the charge, and dash down into the feather, which uh, we probably mash ourselves against that wall. So we go to the right, we're in a feather, and then we go down and jump off of here. We go, we go down and land on this conveyor, dash upward, get this thing, drop the battery, dash around, and... Oh, there's a, there's a battery platform right there. So that suggests we do have to put both batteries in here. So we grab the battery, hop off here, and the level keeps going because it's longer. So the first battery is falling out. We hop into the feather with it. We bounce. We... Do not go up there, that's bad. We... Have to... Oh, maybe we do. Maybe we do. Maybe we go up here and then we dash down and around. Then right here, we throw it into the last thing, it hits the battery thing, then it probably parts these, and these platforms lift us up all the way to the top. Alright, let's do it. That's one. Dang it. That's better. There we are. Bounce. Bounce. Dang it. Okay, we do fill this one up here. Whoops. There we are. Oops. Um, right, I want to want to dash to the left. Bam! Throw it. Alright, that opened it. And then I have another dash, right, because I dashed off with the feather. So I, I'm up there, I have another dash, then I go down. I do not grab the next battery right away. Almost, almost. Yeah, I'm surprised at how good I am with Super Dash. Definitely better than Gravity Helper. Although this level does have the uh, easiest Gravity Helper that I have ever used. Maybe it's just because I got practice with Strawberry Jam. Gravity Helper was definitely less frustrating in this level than in the rest of my experience. Yeah, oh, I forgot what to do. Not that. That. Oh yeah, progress. All right, come on. Can I first try this part? Huh? No! All right, now it's time for, oops. All right, here we go. Yeah. Is that the end? That's the end of the section, isn't it? Time until resurface. Uh, less than an hour. So I, I slept for it. All right, resurface. There's one more segment left. I'm no longer super dashing. Hey, it's Metroid again. All right, so this, right.
All right, so this will be the theme for the next time. All right. Oh man, more gravity helper, please. Hey, look, we have two dashes. Wait, is up the way we have to go? No, this way, okay. We have two dashes. We're gonna explore up here right now. There's nothing up here, but I'm gonna explore here just because. Uh, nope, not the right height. What if I go up here? Nope, still not high enough. Yeah! Nothing special, but it was fun. Oh, hey, there's a thing. Chapter one, Superfecta, readability, sideways jump through Maddie's, Maddie's helping hand. All right. All right, cool. So I guess Maddie's helping hand is the, the helper that, that, um, oops, no, 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 dang it. That allows you to have sideways jump throughs. All right. Well, that was it for this episode of Superfecta. We got one more. The vote is still open on Patreon. And you can head on over there to vote. And um, one more video before we start something new. I'm excited. This one was fun. I love the Super Dash. More Super Dash, please. That's a, a lot of fun. But yeah, what a fun section. I feel like I kind of breezed through it a little faster than some of the others. And I was, I was surprised that that was the last room. I was like, wait, did I count right? There isn't another one, is there? But yeah, that is it for this episode of Superfecta. Thank you all so much for watching. Let me know what you thought in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more uh, Celeste mods and other awesome games. I'll see you next time. Bye.